hey, 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 what's happening, founders of the world? Hey, Red, Redford, you hoarder, you hoarded my slot. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Very good. It doesn't matter to me. Red knows he can go past every day uh, because I got nothing, but it's okay to have nothing. You know why? Because I got a feeling. You remember that song? It's funny. It's funny. I was just telling, texting Janet uh, Butler because I wanted her to come on and talk. She's going to come on and talk Thursday, and we're going to promote her thing that she's doing on Friday, her back-to-school thing. And uh, I said, didn't you ever hear Van Halen hot for teacher? You got it bad, got it bad. And she's like, no, I was like doing jumping jacks and playing hula hoops <laughs> at that age. I mean, my, that old, my goodness. How can you not know who Van Halen is? Anywho, let me tell you what's going on today. Red, great lives subconsciously. It's in my mind. I know exactly what you said. I was talking to Marty here a minute ago, and he was giving me a compliment. I'll tell you about that in a minute. But let's go. What's what is today? Tuesday. It's it's terrific Tuesday. So we have Red, me. We have Comfort at eight. Red, me, Marty at twelve. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Who else is going on today? I know Roblin live every single night. 8 o'clock, the Mad Hatter and Lynn. And then you have, uh, I don't know if, if Andy Burks and Collins are going to go on today with Comfort. I'm not sure. But Comfort's at 4. I hope so because it's a really good show. I love it. Uh, and everyone else I'm forgetting about. Anywho, maybe Engineer Mike's in there. I don't know. I don't always pay attention to what's going on. I try to. I have failed today the mission. Anyway, let me do the birthdays real quick because I had I have only a couple. Deborah J. Long, hey, happy 61st birthday to you. Gasby Latham, I don't know how old you are. John Batakis, happy birthday. Isaiah Stephen, happy birthday. And Adam Cordor, I used to work with Adam. Happy birthday to you. All right, let me get back here. Make sure no one's texting me. Uh, so what's happening? Uh, you know what? I went on, uh, Manu Miller had a, another uh, Oak Connect last night. We jumped on there, had a lot of fun. Actually, it was really fun. And before I got on there, you guys know Brendan. He was actually doing sign language with our with our good brother, Cecil Ware, who's, who's, who's deaf. And I missed that part. I, I kind of wish I could have saw it. But if you know Brand, Brandon, just the miracle man, I call him the amazing man. Doing some really cool things. Gerald, Gregor, thank you very much for the super sticker. <laughs> So now you guys heard yesterday, a lot of people's old mails were turning on. They were going, going. I know some people that they, they turned off uh, because they're still working on it. But don't panic, please. There's three top people that I wanted them really to get going that I know a person. It was Narelle, Willow, and Brian. And all three said, oh, they were working, and now uh, they're not working. That means when they're doing that, they're, they're working on it. Just stay calm. Uh, Gina and Leva, I hope you're having fun on your vacation. Love the pictures, uh, what you're showing of Lake Michigan, because that's really, that's a cold lake too, but it's beautiful. And it's deep. It's really deep. There's some treasures lost that I'll be, uh, I'll be doing some scuba diving, but it's very dangerous to scuba dive in that lake, but someday. But anyway, back to Unpassive. So, you know, I'm going over my mind last night. What do I got to say? I tried the night before thinking about what I want to talk about in my lives. And sometimes it's always not that easy. I got so much going on in my personal life. All right, you got to get back in the game. Come on, stay with it, stay with it. And then I start thinking about all the things that we have. I mean, the, the things that I, I never expected. No, nowhere when I first signed up for this, all right, when I first signed my NDA, did I have any uh, expectations. I just thought, oh, Pete sure said you're going you're gonna to make some, some good uh, online money. You, you don't have to do anything, but all that other stuff that came in afterwards was like bonuses. Like when they said, you know, the Burj Khalifa, I'm, I'm good. Hey, Chris, Chris, you're going to Boston with a bunch of us. Uh, there's going to be a big surprise there. And I'm like, wow, 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 wow. We get all these people together. We go to Boston. Boom. We're looking at the Burj Khalifa. All right. Then it was the offices in Burj Khalifa. Could have that backwards. Maybe. All right. The train station. Uh, Egypt really blew me out of the water. Singapore, Bangladesh, India. What is next? What's next? And I keep saying, hey man, all I did was sign up to make a little bit of income. 
I had no idea it was going to be this big. And I think a lot of you, uh, and you know, and when I say I think a lot of you, I'm only saying that out of my head because that's what I'm thinking. So I'm assuming subconsciously, right, Red, that you're thinking what I'm thinking. I had no idea what I got into or was getting it. You know, I thought it was all right. Some guy, he he designed something. Where uh, You have a troll. Oh, I know. He's always on there. It's okay. Hi, Chris McNair. Trolling again. He's got nothing else to do. That's okay. Let him go. We don't care. He can say whatever he wants to say. We don't believe him anyway. <laughs> uh, but thanks, Red. But anyway, Chris McNair, by the way, we have all these places. Uh, and, and Chris will say something like, you haven't made no money. Yeah, we don't. Chris, that's, that's the truth. None of us have made any money. You can say whatever you want about donations or super stickers. Because your sisters that do a YouTube... They get super stickers too, so stick it up your uh, fauca there. <laughs> um, and uh, if you start thinking about how big this really is and what you don't know yet, there's things that you really don't understand what he's actually doing. I mean, the the, the server centers, the mobile, I just stuff that I never thought about would happen. I really thought, okay, I joined something. I paid $97, which, by the way, is coming back to me. And uh, I thought this guy made something where he created a system where everyone's got to get paid uh, through sales through the company, marketing through the company. And I'm thinking, well, okay, I didn't expect all the rest of this to happen. I didn't expect anything about the Burj Khalifa or Dubai, Egypt. I didn't, I had no idea that that was part of the deal. And the thing is, uh, (laughs) the thing is, we have so much more that's coming. All right. Right now, I know I know the old Ash Mafara is working his brains off, doing everything he can to get to make everyone happy. And you know, this guy out here making the comments, just ignore him. It's okay, it's okay because because we know the truth. You just keep telling yourself that because when you are uh, earning an income from a passive on their efforts, not yours, but you can help. We know that you're going to turn out and you're going to be okay and. Uh, this guy on here, Chris McNair, he's going to want to join. Even though he said, oh, I'll never join. Good, good, Chris. Don't ever join, really. Don't ever don't ever want to change your life. <laughs> uh, oh, because it's not ready yet, Chris. Chris, the Burj Khalifa offices are not ready yet. That's the truth. All right. Uh, did you see the inside of the Empire State Building, why they were building it? Did you see the inside of any building uh, while they were decorating the offices? No, you haven't. You haven't, Chris. So, so anything you got, I can I can come back with an answer. It's just a it's a bad ping pong game. Uh, <laughs> my my order is on the way from my grocery shopping. Uh, but think about all the stuff that we have right now. That's unbelievable. And uh, and yeah, we get people like this on here who. Who, who I don't know why I want to be so negative to it. And I don't know why, Chris, that my my business has to be in your mouth all the time or any one of us. That's what probably doesn't bother me. I just know that if I didn't believe in something or I didn't like something, I certainly wouldn't waste my day on it every day. And that's what you seem to do. So I'm uh, blown away by that. So your stamina for being negative or trying to think you're saving other people, you're not. What are you saving us from? What do you think you're saving us from? I don't know. I don't know. Go back to, I hear all these other companies and your sisters there that always want to make fun of us, but there's a lot of businesses out there that are online that aren't really healthy. Uh, and like I said, I was, wasn't that guy that ever did any of this stuff. I never did the the MLMs and all that. Did I believe me? I had friends say they were making some money. They never made a lot of money, but it was just someone that took a chance. What's wrong with people taking a chance, Chris? The thing is, I took a chance, and then I realized that, wow, this is bigger, biggest chance. Oh, my God, it's just not a chance. It's, it's a changing effect that it's going to affect everyone in this world. All right? And it has. Uh, we have people from all over the world, Chris. Yes, we have people very, very under the poor standards. We have middle class. We have rich. We have engineers. We have doctors. We have lawyers. We have soldiers, Chris. People that were in the service, why? Why? A lot of those, because they know what Opalus is going to do to help out the soldier that came home or our vets 
that were poorly taken. I don't hear you complaining about that. What about for the last 50 years, how bad vets were, they just were taken. No one paid attention to them. They were spat on. We want to we want to show people the world how proud we are of them. We want to help them. Yeah, Michigan, we have the biggest homeless vets in the world. That's going to change. See, Chris, that's what we're talking about here. That's what a passive is. All right, I can I can go on the internet and knock people all day long. Oh, this is crap. Yeah, the, but see, I don't I don't know why I'd waste my time ever doing that. Let me see. I'm going through some. Well, no, I don't like that. Next. No, I don't like that. Next. Don't do it. Don't do it. You ignored an Oblast project for our active duty service members. I did. I didn't. I didn't ignore anything, guys. I have. I've got thousands of them waiting. Oblast hasn't launched yet. I've not uh, ignored anything. You know, servicemen are the number one on the top list. Okay, that's a big, big priority. So um, <laughs> this is just a great live today. Uh, I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. All right. But anyway, be happy. Remember, people are going to throw bricks at you no matter what. All right. People are going to throw. I'm trying to do the right thing and the good thing, and I still get bricks thrown at me. And that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. But. I don't know what's happening this week. Uh, I think I have a feeling that something's going to happen this week. I know, like I said, the OMAIL will ask said is one of the things that we're holding us back was he wants everyone's OMAIL to work properly. And he told you about uh, the 7,800 7, people that got stuck. They had to redo it. Uh, a lot of people were yesterday who said, Chris, it works, it works, it works. That was one of the things that were holding us back from actually going. I believe he's got all the pay structure, in my opinion. Everything intact, everything ready to go. But he wants to just, you know, shine a few things up. Yeah, uh, you see something there, or we we send some in. They this this doesn't look so good. Check it out, and they check it out. So that's all. That's all. I wouldn't be. Uh, I don't get upset about it. I just kind of go about my day. All right, go about my day and just let people know. When they'll text me what's going on. Everything is going on. Um, we are ahead of schedule. We're not behind schedule. The only time we're behind schedule is when you wanted to be behind schedule. So just ignore all that stuff. Um, uh, as Red talked about subconscious, you know, uh, when you put something in your mind, and this is what people uh, like this guy in here, what they want to do. They want to try to put a little put a little cancer in your brain. Ah, I'll make them think about this. See, I don't think about any of that stuff that you send me or that's negative. It doesn't. It's just a waste of my time. I just refuse to look at stuff like this. Um, I'm part of a company that's going to change the world. Um, I got to put my two cents in to everything that was happening in this company. Uh, as far as, oh, no, hey, did you see this? My ideas that I have, Ash loves to hear, not only mine, but everyone's. He loves to hear them. Um, oh, bless is going to be big. No one, no one's being ignored or... or uh, uh, it just hasn't happened yet. All right. What good we now Ash already did his old blessed project showing him. I've done a few myself with the help of all of you, but we didn't call him Obless. Okay. <laughs> so Ob now look at you can't you can't you can't launch Obless first before any of the products. Whole idea is once people start generating money. Now they have money to help Oblast projects. You get that? A lot of people ask. That's a question people ask. How come we didn't launch Oblast yet? Well, because if you, you haven't made any money. Unless you want to come out of your own pocket and donate. Donate, which a lot of people do. Okay? That's that's okay. But Oblast is not there yet. It's going to be. It's not far away. But how about let's let's get some paid products going and let's earn some income and then, and then I'm sure Ash Mafar will talk about Bless. And I think you'll be blown away what he's got to talk about it. All right. He just doesn't say it. He does it. He has everything in place. Oh, my gosh, does he have a lot of things in place? I got to watch the clock. I forgot I started late here. Um, but stay away from, you know, if you know there's a hole in front of you and you're walking, are you going to walk into the hole or you walk around it? Walk around things that, are, are, that just aren't good. Uh, we have... 
a million, four hundred thousand, let's say seven, eight hundred thousand people, because we know a lot of people bought extra accounts. Okay. Uh, you said Ash is giving you money for a bless. Who is this Joe guy? Uh, Joe, Ash donated some money to a, a family in and passive through me and through the Seeds Academy. Did he know he was donating? I don't know. But he also did a whole bunch of things when they had that massive earthquake. Uh, wasn't really called a bless, bless yet, if you understand what I'm saying. And uh, <laughs> I know Dave Wozleski. But just pay attention to what, what we already have. Stay in the now. Don't worry about what other people say. Uh, I have family members that tell me the same thing every day. I just ignore them. I say, I believe in this. If you don't believe in it, it's okay. Go about your day. That's that's it. Am I still going to take care of my family when all this is said and done? Absolutely, I will. Why, why hold hate in your heart? And there's some people like this guy saying some pretty mean things once in a while. It doesn't matter to me. Man, I just... I, it bounces off me, dude. It really does bounce off me. On passive is the future of the internet. It's the future to help people out with their problems. It's got every solution out there. The problem is your brain just doesn't expand that far to think about that. Why? Because it's never happened before. Oh, Chris, this is a scam. This guy's taking you for a ride. He ain't taking me nowhere. You know where he's taking me? To places that I want to go. He showed me a different way and how it is because it's going to be done. He's very transparent about all of that. So just listen to what he's got to say. If it's not in the back office, don't post it out. A lot of people post out the wrong information. And uh, just be happy because I'm telling you right now, very soon, things are going to change. Before you know it, Ash is going to pop something in that back office and say, are you ready? <clears throat> are you ready? Excuse me. That's what you should be looking for. That's what you need to pay attention to. Okay. Nothing else. Nothing else matters, period. All right. That last week. I don't know. Well, Red, Red did a great live and he said it was his opinion, Chris. You got to understand, Chris, this is America and we do we are allowed to tell our opinions like you're doing. All right. I'm not throwing your dumb ass out of here, which I should, but I won't. You want to state your opinion? Go ahead. I'm fair. I'm fair about it. It's okay. Uh, you pick on my my brothers or my sisters, I get a little tipsy, tipsy mad uh, because I know what they're trying to do. They're trying to help people, unlike yourself. Anywho, all right, what time is it? I've completely wasted this live on another ding dong <laughs> who doesn't want to listen, but that's okay because I respect your opinion and I will agree to disagree. But I love the rest of you, and I think that uh, – I think that you all know where you're at, regardless of what people say to us. I think, you know, the, the proof in the pudding will be when this really gets going. And I think it's going to be pretty soon. And, and I, I said some, someone called me the other day is, and actually said, you know, I'm so glad we didn't launch this a couple of years ago when everyone wanted to. Even when Ash said, you're right, because he's seen things that weren't working properly. He wanted to get them fixed. Uh, I love that fact. I worked for Ford Motor Company, Mazda Motors. I watched them do things they shouldn't have done and still ship the car off the record. Okay. <laughs> Remember that this is the, this is the first company. My groceries are here. This is the first company. Thank you. That, that is doing the right thing. Hey man, I can, I can nitpick Ford motor company, Mazda motors, Chrysler, Gia. I can nitpick all those companies, but I won't, I won't do that. I could go on online and nitpick all kind of people like Chris Miner, how he doesn't have a life and uh, his life is to pester people. <laughs> Man, that's, how much does that pay you, Chris? Hey, Chris, how much does that pay you? Now, I have a little respect because I know what you you fought for this country. I got a lot of respect for that. But what I don't have respect for is you knocking the people that you fought for freedoms for. That's what I don't have respect for. But because it is America, and uh, you fought for those freedoms. See, I'm pretty good about that. I agree with that kind of stuff. I don't like shutting people down, even though I want to sometimes. But a passive is going to open up the doorway to uh, your brothers and sisters that did serve to help them out. Uh, there's a lot of things out there, so they say, but I never see them help anybody out. Honest to God, truth. All right. 
Uh, let me say hi to a few people because I got a couple more minutes. I apologize, guys, for going off in a rant sometimes, but you know what happens. Ruthie Pace, Pam Turner, Frank Rowe, Raphael. Um, and then remember again, Janet's going to do a call in on Thursday to talk about her show. Uh, Ishwar, uh, Theta King, how you doing? Faith, Faith, Faith. I love that name. You guys got to have faith. Uh, Yin Yang 444, KCE Zevenbergen. Shorty will be saying that next. Zarka, thank you very much for the super sticker. Uh, <laughs> thanks, Red. Thanks. It ain't always easy being me. I had a boss. His name was uh, Marchese. He used to say, it ain't easy being cheesy. So, uh, But I think, you know, the truth is, Red, you're listening to me. If you just tell the truth, it, the truth will set you free no matter what. Uh, as this beautiful symbols up here, the truth will always set you free. Now, when you're, when you're trying to teach people the truth, sometimes they just don't listen, but that's really on them. As long as you're doing the right thing, uh, you're going to be all right. See, I, I plan on going to heaven. I don't like doing anything that's, uh, that would put me in that, that pit of fire. And, and even people I don't like, I still pray for them. Honestly, that's the truth. Uh, Kushal, what's happening? My Raquino, you can't handle the truth. That was a good one. Tanya Henner, what's happening? Cena, this has been long. Uh, brother, no, I have not heard from Bruce. I'll text him, I'll text him today. Bruce Gerstein, I'm sure you're talking about. Uh, I'll see what, what's going on with him, bud. Thank you for letting me know that. Uh, <laughs> Akram, what's happened? Had fun with some with Akram last night. Uh, Lister T, the Twisted Sister number one, Gem is on your summer. Lori Lun, the Horse Whisperer. <laughs> I, that still cracks me up. If anyone hasn't heard from Bruce Gerstein, uh, you know, he might be traveling still. I'm not sure if he came back. Someone uh, put in here. I'm going to try to contact him. I'd appreciate other people would do. Kevin Rutledge. <laughs> If everyone flies too fast for me to catch names, love you all. Pam Turner, what's happening? Patty Parent, what's going on, Patricia? Burgess, Ishwater, uh, Marie, Cheryl Bass, Theta. Do, 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 do. Gladys, what's happening, Gladys? How you doing? Allison, how you doing? You're welcome for what I don't know. I'm only doing what I got to do. Diane Lennon, what's happening? Uh... Jepeth, Chatter, Ishwar, Abdi Alasso. Here's a tough one. Kamala Shuresh 69. Oh, boy. Uh-uh. I just done drowned in that one. Raphael, Gina, Livia. <laughs> what did Kevin say? Rose. I always miss Rose every day. Rose, I apologize. So, Rose, 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 Rose. There, I just made up for it. Ruthie Pace, how you doing, my beautiful sister? Yusuf, what's happening? Uh, Hollybug Phillips. Marcia and the Dancing Queen. Uh, Irina, how you doing? Uh, there's a lady on here. She's not on here today. Kiana. Kiana. I know I said your name right. I was trying to learn it last night. I don't see it. James Black. What's happening? Uh, I think I got everyone. Okay, guys, if I missed you, I apologize. And those who were seen dancing were thought to be insane by those who could not hear the music. Ooh. That's got to be what Jane's uh, talking about. That's a good one, Kev. I like that. Absolutely. That's really good. Let me read that again. And those who were seen dancing were thought to be insane by those who could not hear the music. Man, that's that's really good, Kev. That's like poetic. Veronica, how you doing? Uh, I'm getting close. I always get that one bad, too. Rose again. Ishwire Myra. Ooh, I think I got everyone tonight. Yin Yang 444, four, four, I got you. Uh, Chris McNair. <laughs> Ranjit. Do, 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 do. I think I got everyone. Kushal. I got everyone. My M. Kelly was number one today. Shirley Dodson. Okay, what time is it? 11.58. I love every one of you. Happy birthday to the birthdays today. Uh, make sure you blow them up. Make sure, you, please make sure you pray for Chris McNair that God gives him a better attitude. Because <laughs> Chris, Chris, 
Where I'm going, you're more than welcome to come. But if you don't, I'll just wave to you. It's okay. I love every one of you. God bless. Marty's coming on in three minutes. Uh, and go have some fun with Marty DeGarmo. And uh, make sure you check out your back office constantly. Because I think Ash is going to do a popping surprise this week. It's just my feeling. I got a feeling. All right, guys. I love every one of you. God bless. See ya.